Hey everyone, Brian here with Audio Plugin Deals. Today we're going to check out the action filter from Noise Ash. It's a really cool plugin. Before we get started, make sure you like the video, leave us a comment, let us know what you think, and of course, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already, and hit that bell notification icon so you know when we go live with videos and great deals just like this. All right, guys, so action filter. Um, you may be familiar with the action delay we did from Noise Ash. This is going to be the action filter, and I love these kind of filter modulation effects. So all I'm going to do is take a pretty much just a square wave. And then we're going to hear how much life and movement you can get in the most simple sound possible, this by adding the action filter. So that one's very basic. We're just going to take a look at some of the presets here um, from beat miscellaneous to models. Now that says beat kick. It's going to be more of a rhythmic style sound, fairly basic. So let's go on to some of the others. <laughs>
All right, so you can hear how he just takes some very basic sounds. Um, this can add, you know, rhythmic effects, kind of like a chopper, chopping uh, style, as well as like a smooth sine wave flow style. Um, you know, you can add your own custom shapes. You saw me doing that with some of them and really start to kind of tweak and distort the sound uh, with those two different filters there from high pass, band pass, a notch filters, high pass, low pass, anything like that. And then you can also adjust the sync rate of those uh, shapes down there so the sign the triangle saw square as well as the custom shape and you can even hit randomize so there's a lot of different kind of tonal shaping possibilities with this plugin um, as you could hear at the end it's, it's kind of fun to, to kind of mangle the sound and you really never know what you're going to get if you just hit the random function um, or draw your own custom shape play with the two filters and then you can get some really kind of wild results with it you can also just use it as a very basic uh, just high pass low pass filter or just kind of getting a basic gating effect um, to add some uh, movement to your sounds even something as basic as a square wave from Omnisphere or a pad from Omnisphere whatever you want to use it on so that was a quick look at it action filter from noise ash the palmary action filter uh, similar to the action delay both part of the palmary collection from noise ash so thanks for checking this one out with me I I will see you guys next time.